On today's Open Ears, Marian Anderson. Marian Anderson was an American contralto known as the voice of the century. She performed a wide range of music, from opera to spirituals all over the world. She was born on February 27, 1897, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. At six years old, she became a choir member at the Union Baptist Church, where they nicknamed her Baby Contralto. In 1925, she won a contest organized by the New York Philharmonic Society, which gave her the chance to sing at Lewison Stadium in New York. Three years later, she performs at Carnegie Hall for the first time and receives a scholarship that takes her to Europe. By the 1930s, she is well known on both sides of the Atlantic. In 1936, Anderson is invited to perform at the White House, becoming the first African American to receive this honor. However, in 1939, the Daughters of the American Revolution denied her request to perform at Constitution Hall because of her race. There was a public uproar that led Eleanor Roosevelt to resign from the DAR in protest, and she invites Anderson to perform at the Lincoln Memorial on Easter Sunday. On April 9th, Anderson gives a moving performance. In 1955, Anderson became the first African-American to perform as a member of the Metropolitan Opera. At age 68, Anderson gives her last concert of the farewell tour at Carnegie Hall. Marian Anderson died in 1993 in Portland, Oregon at the age of 96.